Maybe you just can't save it and the game will just fucking break. Well, that's not correct looking. Wait, do you have to collect all this shit to get the fucking secret level, like, enabled? At this point, I never want to see this game ever again. I'm fucking done with Quake 2. Okay, no. Yo, no, you do. You do. You, in fact, do have to collect every single individual thing there. Just like a big waste of time. There, okay. The, the, what? the inverted mass has fucked me up now. Now it just seems weird. God mode on. So wait, let's see if this is what makes me, uh... Okay, where's my Vine G? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Vine G. Use grenades. Out of item grenades.
this shit just gonna... Is the game just gonna crash for no reason? death animation and then he give Yo, I can't see shit. I don't know, saving might just cost the thing to crack. Oh, isn't that grand? It's inverted every time? What in the fuck? Oh, fucking... The random spread shots that gunners do with their grenades. Got oh shit. Oh no. <laughs> oh, okay. There's a normal guy. So, I've noticed, uh, they have a BFG gladiator, but they don't have any of the actual mission pack enemies. What the hell are you doing? I haven't seen any mission pack stuff. Mutants have more fucked up uh, physics than uh, fiends do, for sure. Oh, shit. <laughs> of course, he was gonna do that. Oh, thank you. Oh. 
Oh yeah, there was the uh, parasite. That was over here. What the heck? How many shells did that just give me? Lowered. Oh yeah, there's the uh, the water area. It's so damn dark you can't see a damn thing. was all just forgotten at, huh?
Oh shit. Just a second ago. Rockets, rockets, rockets. The fucking ground zero AI. It's just like, ah, eh, you know, forget about the other attacks that the tank can do. It's just the, uh, the rocket that's actually, you uh, know, dangerous. Give me something if I kill. No. And do I get my health back by going back to the hub? Nope. Yeah, that's one thing. Whenever a new map loads or anything, the uh, inverted mass comes back. I was gonna suck me up. on me. Oh, hey, there is mission pack enemies. Okay, cool. I'm glad to see that. Yeah, go get them. I was gonna say, really? They, they leave out the mission pack enemies, but they have a uh, fucking <laughs> BFG dudes? Alright, I guess we have to Alert the alarm. Oh. And 
Why is that Berserker still punching? How come neither person is done? Dude, they give you a shitload of ammo for uh, the shotgun ammo boxes. I guess uh, the mod wanted uh, wanted to be sure that the uh, player would use the double barrel shotgun even more. Fucking oh, shit, the surfer lost. Use the shotgun more than uh, you usually. to do that or something? Oh, fucking dickhead. Yeah, the uh, the shotgun boxes, bubble boxes, they give you 20 now, it looks like, instead of the uh, 10. Fucking, I hate that shit. The uh, sprite shot on the grenades, I really... That's just, it's just annoying. I know it's like, oh, it makes them more, uh, you know, dangerous, but... It's like, why don't the tanks just do that? Why doesn't every single enemy just randomly shoot around you? It'll make them more dangerous. Get my little protector. <laughs> See, shouldn't I be doing this uh, pistol start? Because like I shouldn't have a, uh, like I shouldn't have the railgun, right? Is this actually like, this is a like a community map pack, so I can't imagine that the maps are based around the player having these weapons. Nice tank. mean that there are multiple maps in one uh, thing? Wow. 
Well, I'll be. I didn't expect that. Oh, yeah. The fuckers. <laughs> Inverted mouse. I'm gonna keep bringing it up, because what's gonna keep appearing? And also, what the absolute fuck? Why? Hey, oh, goodness, guys. <laughs> that dude's corpse blocked. Oh. Hello. Oh man, he got fucking. Do not bring back that guy. Jeez. Stuck on something. Is that another medic? Yep. What in the hell is that? Feel? And now I can't. Okay. For <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> it just covers up my uh, L. Is that, that that doesn't have a dude on it. That's just a uh, sector turret. Okay. I destroy you. This little effects means getting damage, right? Oh, fucker. Oh man, when where, where was this? Oh shit, it's back here. Before I went into the new area, damn it. I could just do this. Fucking God, this stupid fucking mob. It's the alarm. Oh. And 
and the medic. Bro, did I take a screenshot? Oh, this fucker. Why are you down here? Ah! Oh. Disable the... Uh, this is a hot start here. Oh, you little bitch. Oh, you fucking get off. Uh, no, okay. Is there another medic? Oh my, how many fucking medics I got in this area? Did you fuck off? Oh my god. Thank you. Well, I'm out of there. Thank you. Jeez. I feel. That's a pretty good fight. I really like that fight. Oh yeah, this thing. This thing that's ow, seemingly unkillable. Yeah, it's just normal. Oh. Hey, get out of my way. Oh. Alright, that works. Is this thing gonna just rain hell down on me? Something's obviously not right here. Oh, hey. Ion River. I mean, the Ion River is practically a hyper blaster. Hey, Pat. How's it going, dude? Were you watching earlier, or did you play this mod yourself? Is this another area? Okay, this just leads here. Okay, so these both take you to the same map. So, 
what are we up to? Oh shit, look at that armor. How you guys there? Uh oh. Oh yeah, man. Quake 2 is a great game. I guess you have to go from it this way to get that armor. Dude, coming from this direction at first seems like a suck ass. It doesn't look like anything's out there. Look how much damage that rocket does. If it hits you dead on, that does 100 health and also 25 armor. trying to accomplish here. Here's the power cube. this area yet. So I do that just to extend the bridge in the other level. I think that's this whole area is just a little bit unnecessary. Yeah, I was kind of uh I thought I was pretty mad. Oh shit. I I did my I did a playthrough of Dark Forces not long ago. Yeah, 
Yeah, that level... Where you actually... Well, in that level, when you actually start fighting the uh, aliens, it's when you realize, oh, there's not gonna... Like... There's not gonna be any fun enemies to fight in this game, is there? Well, I thought the Dark Troopers were fun to fight. But the Dark Troopers were like the only enemies I thought were actually like fun to fight. All of the Imperial dudes were completely interchangeable. Oh yeah, the mines. What the hell? Oh yeah. What button is the Ion Ripper part of? Oh great. It's not attached to any of the keys. So I have to go through the inventory to grab it. And then, well, when you get the Dark Trooper gun by the end of the game, and it just pretty much just annihilates every enemy. Like, even Dark Troopers get annihilated once you get the Dark Trooper gun. That's interesting. So am I gonna get a jetpack here? If I, I gotta disable these lasers and I can get a jetpack. That's pretty cool. Ow! <laughs> That's not a good place to drop a food safe. But yeah, that was my thoughts. Was I, I forget, it was one of the alien levels. I think it was when uh, you go through the, uh... oh yeah. Don't, oh my god, he actually, I'm stuck, he's stuck in me, he's stuck in me, I can't move. <laughs> yeah, fuck him, dude. Yeah, but I think it was around like the Alien City level where I was just like, oh my god, the level design is unbearable in this game. Hey, I just did a quick save. Oh, I think that's a BMG Gladiator down there. Here's the Daedalus. I was wondering when this guy would show up. Ow, my ears. Ow, my ears! Fucking bastard. Yep, it's a, uh... Yeah. Thank you very much. Very nice. Ow. Oh, shit. The fucking... The fucking mouse. Uh... 
Really? You watched my gameplay video? Nice. Uh, and I keep forgetting that it's not, you can't get to it through the keyboard. I can't... I can't really afford him to shoot through the doorway. Alright, he's fucking dead. Now this guy that's gonna rape my ears. Okay. Nice. I thought it said I disabled the turret. Why this... Why? 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 I'm sorry. I'm pretty fucking sure. Oh my god, the fucking. That this fucking game said I disabled that hurt turret. Ow. Shut the fuck up, tank. I, the only, there's a config file in the folder, but I did, uh, look it up and check it, because, uh, G, in this mod, by default, pressing the letter G will activate god mode, instead of taking out grenades. So I had to rebind it so that it, <laughs> it would be grenades and not god mode. I can't, yeah, it's... Ridiculous, I don't understand. Hey, Jimmy. Yeah, it's, it's been pretty fun. I've like this map has been really good. Okay, this one, this time the turret actually was the same. This author, whoever this author is, made a good, uh... It's been pretty fun, this one. Uh, but there's been some technical difficulties, but... Hell, isn't that every fucking Quake 2 stream? This piece of crap game that I never want to see again in my entire life. What'd that do? Oh. Oh yeah! What was the secret here? No, 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 get in my way. Yeah, isn't there a, uh, yeah, what the fuck is this? I gotta get in there. But how? Yeah, it, it, they said it was uh, compatible with Yamagi, even though I still, they, there was a map that crashed on me. I don't know how you get that secret. I want it, though. I just think- oh yeah, every single time there's a transition, it re-enables invert mouse. So I have to go back in here and say no to invert mouse. Every time. 
I have no idea who in the fuck plays any first-person shooter or anything with inverted mouse controls. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this ain't gonna be good. Oh, what the fuck was that attack? What was that attack? I don't even know what kind of bad guy that was. What is this? What is this black crap? Yeah, I know. Hello, 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 hello. There is something really weird going on in this room. There's some kind of like boss enemy or something in this room. Don't shoot more grenades at me, Dicko. What was that? What is this like black crap? What is going on? So it looks like there's a new, like, grunt soldier that has some kind of- Oh, fuck, is this guy? Some grunt soldier that has- No, wait, don't- Ah! I was gonna try to melee cheese him. Yeah, there seems to be a lot of bullshit. So they have like a new cannon fodder enemy that has some kind of like super attack. Yeah, this fucking guy. God, the enhanced, uh, the enhanced difficulty, uh, like the enhanced AI that the gunners have is fucking. I can't fucking stand it. It's so... It's such a fucking pain in the ass. I mean, you have to play Quake 2 on Nightmare Difficulty. Alright, there's a lot of bastard enemies in this area. Okay, who's shooting the bomb bombs at me? Hit by it. Thank you. You everyone plays on Black Play. Who doesn't play? If if someone actually plays Heretic and not just like a casual one time thing to just like play the game. Any repeat player of Heretic, I they play it on Black Play. Where is this fucking guy? Oh, did you see these fucking legs? Do you see these fucking dog moves this fucker is doing? What in God's name? Look at that shit. <laughs> Where's 
to be a cheap cunt. Very- oh my god, yep, yeah, I'm fucked. Oh, thank you. Whoever did that to me. Go fuck yourself. The smite my meister. Dude! Oh god. Fuck you. Okay. So look, a heretic is boring if you're not playing it on black light. That's the truth. Ah, oh, bitch. Ah, come on. Go around. Alright, you did. Heretic is a fun game, but only on Black Blade. I would say Heretic, a lot of people sleep on Heretic, but Heretic is actually a legit game. Granted, if you play it on Black Blade. Because normal Heretic is just boring doom. Like, if you play it on normal, like, Smite Meister difficulty, you will play that game like it's a boring doom. Oh my goodness, what a miss. Oh, fucking... <laughs> his bullets go vertical. Oh my god, his fucking grenades go vertical too. Fuck me, this fucking spider's gonna kill me. Son of a bitch. Null entity think. That's not. I don't like that. I don't like whatever that is. Null entity think. Mm. That's what I love whenever I play a Quake 2 mod and I see some, uh, some text showing up. I have no idea what the hell is. Oh, okay, well this thing's open. Oh, damn, look at this. Uh-oh, I better get out of here. Uh, it's gonna... Yeah, the lava's gonna come up. <laughs> but I have to get the stealth kills. Well, it's not a stealth kill. Bug. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck it. Just have to tank the damage. All right. Yeah, bunny hop and straight jumping still exists in this game. Why did that happen? I've never seen, like, corpses act like that in Doom, but I've never seen that happen in Quake 2 before. 
I think I'm gonna have to make this guy walk the plank. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I didn't know if that was an important button or not. I have to press it. Frickin' gunners, man. Gunners, 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 gunners. That's my complaint. That's one of my criticisms on Quake 2. Is, uh, you're gonna see gunners all over the damn place. Gunners all the time. Oh, come on. Yeah. All all these FPS games have one enemy that just gets utilized way more than everyone else. If you play Quake, you're just going to be fighting ogres, and if you play Doom, you're going to be fighting revenants. Uh, I've already been here. Oh, hey, I'm back at the start. Huh. Yeah, if you play Serious Sam, it's clears. Huh. Oh, wait, this door will be unlocked. I'm guessing it's gonna be a BFG guy. Yep, it's a BFG guy, alright. I was hoping it would hit the column, but it did not. It did not hit that column. Yeah, that's gonna be death. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. I think the, uh... BFG gladiators are excessive. I do not think it needed to be a thing that exists. Hmm. Okay, this looks like a boss fight. Oh, what is this? Yo, you see these dudes? What are these dudes? Yeah, maybe they're friendly marines. I hope they're not evil marines, because that sounds like just a pain in the ass to fight. That feels like it sounds like it would be not fun. So I. Prisoners have been released, right? Oh, I hate. Oh, and they got the turrets. They got the turrets. Yo, guys! Uh oh. Yeah. No, the door's locked. The door's locked. Got that chain gun he's got. Yeah, I'm done. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. What? Okay. Is there a way to get the friendly marines to help me? Huh. Huh. 
I don't know. Man, you cannot out you cannot strafe out of that Shango. You just die. You have to okay, I see. <laughs> you have to wait and take cover. You get killed if you're getting shot by that Shango. And the the fucking mouse is inverted. Stop shooting the fucking Jenga! Marines shoot it while they're in their cages. Oh, now the Marines come out. A little late. Look at all these beautiful men. Alright, boys. was pointless. Now this is the uh, hub area, so it just spat me back to the hub. So <laughs> we don't get to do anything with those marines, apparently. Stream one. Prepare to get wet. Be right back. I'm gonna go piss. I mean, I have played Sigil. I haven't done a whole playthrough of Sigil. But, uh, yeah, be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Can't... You know, the, the rockin' cat emote just made me think. I don't think I've ever played a Quake 2 mod that had new music. Have I? Well, I guess Oblivion. I tried playing Oblivion, and that had new music. But yeah, most Quake 2... Most Quake 2 mods and content just use the uh, stock Quake 2 music. That's just Doom 1, Pat. Oh, fuck. Are you serious? You can just walk back? Bruh. Why can you just walk back? That's why the super shotgun was added to Doom 2. People complain about the super shotgun, but the super shotgun was a necessity. Was a necessity. Oh, I come right to it. I guess I'll at some point have to do the music is kinda loud. It's loud in my ears. Um yeah, I'll have to do an actual playthrough of Sigil Pistol Start to see uh, how annoying that will be. If I have to find uh, secrets to get through. Apparently Sigil 2 is also Doom 1. The Doom 2 mod that Romero is making is a completely different map set. Yeah, I know. I don't understand the point of making a Doom 1 mod. Like, let me tell you how you can make a Doom 1 wad. Make a Doom 2 wad, and then just don't use any of the new Doom 2 content. Wow, look at that. It's identical to Doom 1. Doom 2 is literally Doom 1, but with more stuff. So someone making a Doom 1 wad is literally just them going, No, I like less content. I like less stuff. Oh shit! Fucking Daedalus cunt! Fucking just blew the fuck out of me. I guess it's how you gotta jazz things up.
Oh. Oh, fuck, did you? That fucking Iron Maiden bitch completely threaded the needle between... <laughs> between the medic and me. In the wall, I mean. I hear you breathing. Accidentally pick up the neck. Jeez, look how blue that water is. Oh, hell. Where is a rocket launcher? There is no grenade launcher, and there is no rocket launcher in this entire mod so far. What the hell? Uh, the mutant was actually in the first mod, or the first map I played. The first map I played had mutants in it. Dude needs to chill out. It's a grenade launcher. Speak of it though. Give me that. Yeah, throwing grenades is fun and all, but at a certain point, you need a rate of fire. Seriously, not dead yet. Kinda looks like a setup or something. Or it spits me back. Oh. 
Fucking Daedalus, how much health do you got? Oh, see, that's a nice gimmick. There's a real fly problem on Stragos. Like, as soon as somebody dies, flies are ready to start swarming. Yeah, it's probably the, uh, the fly sound effect from, like, whatever... You know, sound library. The sound library that every single game dev used. Yeah, like, how many times have you heard the, uh, zombie man noise from Doom and other things? Oh, fucker. What the hell is this? Chunko, what is that? This looks like a trap. Like when I grab that armor, they're gonna, the, it's gonna trap me in here. Oh, really? Nothing. Oh crap! I can't go for it. Wilhelm screams more like a meme though, than it is like a sound effect that somebody would use. Look at the shat- look at the shadow. It's like an evil... doppelganger. <laughs> Looks more like an evil doppelganger than it does like an actual shadow. It's all- the, the shadow effects are... busted. That's a nice looking pump you made. Okay, good. It's just a it's just a gladiator, everyone. It's no problem. Screen. I can turn on Nye and Vulnerability whenever I want. That's a lot of Iron Maidens. Nice. Look how beautiful that was. Yeah, 
It is. That's what it should say when you pick up a power string. Oh. Oh. Nice new armor. Oh wait, there's gonna be dudes here. Hell, it, it was... Maybe it was a leftover line from like, uh... Like the Doom 3 build of Duke Nukem Forever. Where they're like, oh, FPS's now just have regenerating health. And then they made a uh, Duke say power armors for pussies. But then later they just turned Duke Nukem Forever into yet another <laughs> modern FPS with regenerating health. Oh, damn, dude, what the fuck? Uh oh, it's probably a bad idea. Nah, he's slow. He, he can't do shit. I hear you. Yikes. Where's my, uh, whatever. I'm trying to find the Ripper. Thank you. Oh, hell. What a guy. Oh, it's oh, okay. Thank. You. I would much rather fight this dude than another BFG fighter. Even though this fucker hurts my ears, like a lot of the shielded enemies in this game hurt my ears. Pretty much only two states. There's either you're dead or you're not dead. Hmm, how do you get inside there? There's some bonus goodies. Nothing there, bro. Right. Yep, 
be <laughs> inverted mouse. Prepare to get wrecked. Ooh. Like, inverted on a controller? Okay, there are people out there that play inverted on a controller, but inverted on a mouse? Who in the hell plays inverted on a mouse? Oh, why did I turn- I, I turned it off, even though I'm going to immediately turn it off? Or, well, you know what I mean. <laughs> I have to immediately do it again. <laughs> yeah, seriously. It's like, how do you use... When you're using the computer normally... When you're literally doing anything on the computer... Does the mouse cursor go up when you move up on the mouse? Uh, when you move the mouse up, the cursor goes up. There you go. That's how it should be. No, I am uh, happy that the people making these maps haven't been using the tank commanders. That's what they should Next mod that adds new enemies. Make a tank commander and give it a shield. I heard you. It's just like running into the corner that... set a demon, but hey, look, there's a mutant behind this door. Alright, cool mutant. Nice. 
hurt him a bit. Oh, yeah. In this game? In Quake 2? Yeah. Because, I mean, this was made back when uh, it Software were kings. thing that pops into my mind. I hear multiple parasites. Oh, good golly. Oh no, are you bringing back- yeah, he brought back the damn tank. That's a cool area. I can't see shit. Yeah, Quake 1's good. I mean, it's still, uh... Yeah, back when, uh... It's software. They were on their A-game. Oh man. Nice. I mean, I say that's when, uh... Holy crap. It's software. Hey, look who it is! It's Brain! It's the Brain! Okay, you guys need to oh. You guys need to stop shooting. I say that's when the uh, id software is on their A game, even though I don't uh, I don't really like Quake that much. There's a lot of 25 health packs around. Yeah, not to my knowledge, Jimmy. To my knowledge, Quake 1 was like the only Trent Reznor game. That's true, but I feel like what really helps carry Quake is the uh, level design. And I mean, of course, every good game needs to have good level design. But what I mean is, uh, like the gameplay of Quake, 
the enemies in Quake and the guns are very dull. It's because id Software had such good level designers, I think really carried the weight of Quake 1. But though I do say that, I'll keep shilling for Scourge of Arm again. Like, I- oh shit. He's been- oh. They told him to stay still. Scourge of Armageddon, I think, is legit great. Like, I- I think Scourge of Armageddon is... Like, one of the all-time greatest expansion packs to any video game ever. Because I think it's better than the base game. Oh, yes. Oh, cool, cool. Cool guns, cool guns that these guys have. Cool guns that just annihilate you. Yeah, I guess so. I guess that's what you would call it. Ah, I wasn't quick enough. Oh, the tank is quicker than me. Hey, power shield. <laughs> Hey, we got the commander, so... You know, they said prepare to get wrecked, but that was not even the hardest level in this. I, I feel like a lot of the issues in Duke Nukem's gameplay is for is from the fact that it's an early build engine game. Like... Enemies in Duke Nukem 3D can't even, uh... I don't know. Like, every Duke Nukem enemy is like a non-entity. Like, the enemies aren't even real until they activate. You can see so many instances where you can just see an enemy that just looks like they're frozen and they can't take any damage. You'll shoot them and no damage will be taken. And then uh, they'll like come to life. I was gonna say is enemies in Duke Nukem can't, uh, can't uh, patrol. But the pig cop tank, I mean, not, not, not the tanks, but the, the patrol cars that the pig cops have, literally patrol. So if the patrolling was a part of Duke Nukem 3D, then why the fuck does nothing else patrol? It seems like a huge, like, missed opportunity. Why, why couldn't they have other enemies, like, walking around? Or, you know? That's so weird. Because the fact that they have patrol cars, the patrol vehicles, means that they had the technology. Yeah, I still think Duty Come 3D is a great game, but yeah, it does have some... Uh, it's got some less than perfect stuff in it. That's why uh, in Shadow Warrior, uh, I still think the single player, like the single player campaign, I guess you would call it, I think is better in Duke Nukem 3D than it is in Shadow Warrior, but the gameplay of Shadow Warrior is better than Duke 3D. The, the, the gameplay in Shadow Warrior, I think, is fantastic. 
Alright, that's why it's my favorite. It's personally my favorite build engine game. Oh shit, it's the secret level. Alright, let's see what the secret level is. Yeah, small indie team. God's last wish. They were just coming off of, uh, of Rise of the Triumph. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Wang is the funniest protagonist. Man, alright, it's giving me the B of G10K. Is this gonna be an actual boss level? It's just gonna be, or maybe it's a slaughter fest level. I just thought of that. Oh shit. Yeah, I should have assumed that there was gonna be a uh, berserker is the other direction. For real with all these <laughs> berserkers. Oh hell, would you look at that? It's a tank commander. I was just saying this mod was nice that there weren't any tank commanders. Oh, it's a fucking black m dark matter, dude. Ah, oh, you fucking quake too, fuck. Oh. Oh, Alright. Actually, wasn't much going on in this arena. You can't, you can't strafe up. I think the Hornet is great, because the Hornet is what the Spider Mastermind and Doom should have been. This is what the Spider Mastermind and Doom should have been. The rocket launcher. Dude, especially uh, with Ground Zero. You talk about the uh, the pain elementals. <laughs> so Ground Zero just had an enemy that literally can just spawn like any damn enemy at once. It's about time. Oh, look at that! The hyper blaster too. Look at all these Quake Two guns that I'm just now getting. <laughs> huh. 
Damn, look at this. Like a it's like a Wolfenstein 3D boss room. Oh shit. Warning, lava rising. Oh okay. crap. This isn't a boss room, it's a uh, get out of here. Room. You know the hyperblaster really isn't that great. Hyper Blaster is kind of overrated. Oh, crap. Oh, oh get out of my way. Oh, hello, Hornet, again. Gonna be yet more shit gonna pop up. <laughs> I was thinking that the frickin' the Macron might come out of this door. This has been a pretty good mod. It's been pretty good. Venture beneath the grounds. <laughs> yeah, worth the wait. That extra polish that they've been doing. Oh no, why did I even bother doing that? Another of those, like, Wakeful, I think his name is. Wakeful levels. Where he has, like, these gay little messages throughout it. Jump down, is that why I hit? Where'd that gunner go? Oh, okay, okay he's still up there. Hey, a backpack!
Hey, Roadstar. A new quake in the style of Doom? Wait, what? What would be the point of that? Why don't they just make a new Doom? Well, they haven't had muzzle flashes for so long. Adding muzzle flashes would just look plain weird, man. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's on track to being my second favorite Quake 2 mod. There have been some pretty dang good maps, I think. Pressing X apparently takes screenshots. Thank you, mod. But yeah, no, what I was saying is... Well, this is just me personally, is uh, if they do another Quake game, I hope it's another... Uh, it's another Quake 2 game. As in, it's another Strog. Quake 1 barely has an identity. Alright, and I, I'm not gonna pretend like it does, like other people do. dark fantasy FPS with with there's like high technology in it. Yeah, I know. I liked it better when it was called Doom. I liked Quake better when it was called Doom. Fucking dark fantasy FPS. Get that shit out of here. Oh. Oh man, that sucked. <laughs> yeah. You know one thing that kind of annoys me about Quake 2? is there's no precision weapons other than the uh, railgun. The railgun is like the only precision weapon in this entire game. Oh. 
Immensely, hmm. Is that right? kind of true, but still. It, well, it's like, I know we don't do much with uh, multiplayer on this stream, but... Like, wasn't the Railgun King? Like, isn't the Railgun the King in Quake 2? in the Quake 2 multiplayer scene. Hey, hey, I got the 10 health. Trap, ow. Damn, that was fast. Look at that Z-Aware gunner, man. Oh, he did not make a death noise. I was... <laughs> I thought I was gonna get fucked up there. Really, I was gonna say- that, that room reminded me of Doom. That reminded me of Doom too here. Oh, come on. Really? Another one of these suits? No, we really don't need another one of these dudes. Oh, fuck. All right. Yeah, okay. Yep, that's not good. He is in a really bad spot. Fighting him fighting him in this area. Yeah, this is gonna suck a lot of ass. This is like the this is like designed to fuck you. You can't escape when you uh power armor. Look, we won't be using power armor. See it turned the shields come up so you can't run out of the room. Where'd the guy go? Where did the dude go? What the fuck? Hello? Well, there he is. That, there he is. Oh my god, how... These misses, my dude. Oh, I think I got him. No, he's not. He has not been gotten. There we go. This enemy is just go fuck yourself. No, those guys weren't in the OG. Those guys are new to this mod. They added these guys into this mod. Let me break up the window. Ow. Oh. 
Man, this guy's fucking moves. And the fact that Quake 2 guns shoot slightly to the right of your crosshair is tough. That's also another thing that, like, good god, why has nobody fixed that yet? Why has no one made a mod for Quake 2 that has made it that the crosshair... The guns actually shoot where the crosshair is. Got that loud noise. Yes, I 100% agree with that, World Star. What a jump! Oh my God, you're not dead. Doran. Wait. <laughs> Did I just say the N-word? <laughs> Yo, this guy just dropped the N-word in his Quake 2 mod? I heard bad guys, but where are bad guys? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Ninjas. <laughs> All right, where am I actually going now? It wouldn't be a Quake Wolf map if there wasn't one, uh, where am I supposed to be going? Or... This open up? Oh, hell. Oh, come on, bro. these dudes just hanging out on these boxes. What? Did that, like, home in on me? Oh, yeah. Adrenaline? Hell yeah. Both the up and also the O. Because the mutant spawn. <laughs> Worth it? Why? Well, what? There wasn't any obstacle. Also, look at this Doom 2 door texture. That's being... <laughs> it just looks so weird being used like that.
starting, elevating. at the beginning of the map that you was gonna put some <laughs> gay little messages into the soul. Get it right on top of their head. I mean there was water in Quake too. There were there were times when you swam through water. Yeah, so now it's like I gotta go back to the beginning of the level. I don't even remember where the beginning of the level is. Yeah, there's the rebreather. Though I feel like you don't really need the rebreather in uh, vanilla Quake too. Like, there's no section that you like you need to rebreather in. Freaking mutant is like attacking me as it he's trying to attack me through the wall. Oh. 
Can anyone remind me? I think this is like the beginning of the level, right? Over here? It's like around here? I already hit that. No. In the wall? What is this? What are you talking about? Dude was in the fucking wall. This portal's long gone, what do you mean? Did somebody not finish their map? Somebody didn't finish their map for the, uh... <laughs> for the anniversary? Dude's at me, huh? Okay, yeah, you can still just, you know, melee bait him. Is this it? Activating. Yay. done marine is that it oh shit that's it it just literally closed the game well it's kind of disappointing that there wasn't a uh, like climax to the mod uh that one okay wait a minute i'm just gonna turn it on just to like run to the i'm gonna boot it back up and just like run to that one level I thought these two levels were very good. I think this one uh, is it gonna tell me the name of the level. Oh, what they the they actually want you to play it in order? What you can't just play them? What's the point of having a hub? What's the point of a hub if you can't play the maps in whatever order you want? What the shit? That is dumber than hell. OK. 
Okay, hold up. I think it's this level? Wait a minute, let me actually put on god mode for a second. Hello? Yeah, I think this is the level. Yeah, this level? I thought this level was awesome. This level was really good. That one was like one of my favorite, like, uh, human detainment is what it's called. Human detainment, one of the best. One of the best Quake 2 maps I've seen in my life. And okay, this one, let me just uh, familiarize myself with this one. Okay, this one's this one. What the hell? Where'd Quake 2 go? Huh, I can't boot that mission up for some reason. It just like instantly closes the game when I try to open that map. Wreckage. Yeah, this level, so this is the level where you like had to uh, lower, you had to keep lowering the water to go to the next part of the level. So this level was a good level too. Like yeah, wreckage, wreckage and human detainment. Wreckage and human detainment were fantastic. Oh, that's my uh, that's my review of the twenty fifth anniversary map pack. It's a total of so there's the hub map, of course. Uh, okay, but one, two, three, four, five, uh, technically six? There's five maps, and one of the maps is, well, two maps. <laughs> There's this thing called Tech Base, like, it's called Tech Based. But whenever I try to open it, it just immediately closes Quake 2, so I can't- I don't know what that is. Not a whole lot of people seem to contribute to the uh, 25th anniversary of Quake 2. Sadly. But, uh, yeah, well, dude, whoever made that, I, wait, let me look at the readme. I actually want to see the readme. Uh, you gotta read me. First Quake 2 25th anniversary. Read me. Emerald Tiger. This dude called Emerald Tiger made a detainment uh, base or whatever the hell it was. Human detainment? I hope this dude makes a Quake 2 map set. I would love to see like an actual mod set from this dude. Is it emerald? No. He was part of the Al Alkaline Jam. 
Alkaline from a uh, is a Quake One mod, and uh, I guess he's a yeah a Quake One mapper. Oh shit! Look at this. Wait a minute. Look at this. This is his Quake One map, and would you look at that actual expansion pack enemies? You'd never like. For some reason, people that make Quake maps hate the expansion pack content, and nobody ever fucking uses the expansion pack content, for god knows why. It's just nice to see those little scorpions. What the hell kind of ogre is this? You know, there's like a million fucking quake enemies now. Yeah, it does. The the frickin' the scorpion is pretty much just like it just like twitches around. No, though, that wizard, you mean the, the wizard? Oh, you mean the death enemy? The, okay, yeah, the Grim Reaper, death, whatever you want to call it. Because when you said the, uh, the wizard, I thought of the, uh, Hexen 2 wizard. It's like, that's not a Quake expansion. I've never heard of Scrag called a wizard. I didn't know what they were called for the longest time, and I just called them ghosts. I didn't know that Scrags were called Scrag, so I just called them ghosts. All right, well, I guess that's all the, uh, that's all of the, uh, first-person shooter content that I have. <laughs> That's all the first person shooter uh, content I have got going for me. Well, they make like a ghostly noise. They make kind of like a ghostly noise, you know? And they fly around, you know? Like ghosts. Ghosts fly around. Though. I guess you say that, but, I mean, I say that, well, uh, but ghosts in real life, or, well, <laughs> I don't mean, you know what I mean, ghost sightings in real life, whether you believe that or not, but they aren't flying, but in fiction, ghosts are always flying around, but if you believe ghost reports from real life, uh, they're not <laughs> floating around, they're just, uh, people will see ghosts as just, like, supposed to be, you know, like, people walking around or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're affected by gravity. <laughs> you can't escape gravity. Even in death, you can't escape gravity. All right. Yeah, I'll, I gotta return to Resident Evil 4. I did uh, that one stream of Resident Evil 4 and then I took another break after that one stream. But 
I'm gonna try to get back in there, RE4. Alright. Thanks everyone for stopping by and hanging out. You all have a good day. Later.